warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. My name's Peter Drury, and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter, it's great to be here. We've just been given. the whistle it's a long forward pass aimed in towards the center last ditch defending but that'll do oh, he couldn't get hold of it well he knew exactly what he wanted to do before the ball even arrived and that made the chance far easier he read it before any defender Oh, look, they've started with such intensity, but maybe they just need to add a little composure to their finishing. You know, it's the only thing that's missing so far. He's got away with one there. immediate danger Fair attempt just the wrong outcome has a hit and the ball's come out has a swing at it and out to safety Still goalless. So what now? Ritz Borosiuk played out to the right. There are a few waiting for it. Turns and goes back. Oh, he's found him in space. Tries to dink it in. Flags up. running with the ball can they build on it oh and they really should have been made to pay it right oh he read the situation really well but just couldn't apply the finish just five minutes left until the break let's spell a possession this but very little to show for it 
boot forward. And it's Belanda. Looks to slip it through. Tries a through ball. Luke de Jong. And it's the whistle for half time. And we are up to the break. Well, that half-time dressing room now should be full of encouragement from the way they finished the first 45 minutes. They must restart with the same level of intensity, though. Any drop, and they're going to let this opposition off the hook. They really have to make it count now. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. A tight old game so far. Can that change now? Made sure that that won't get through. Cacciarini. Now the pass. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Corner. Is it out of harm's way? And that certainly packed a punch. Well, they're having a lot of corners, so good variation in quality has to be produced now to have more impact. The defence can get it clear. No, not quite. But there wasn't much on for him, so it was worth a shot. It was worth a try from there. Up towards the hour mark, and still no goals. Yamalenko passes it through. Marusiuk. certain that won't get through it is still anyone's game nil nil Luke de Jong uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there I timed this run brilliantly and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with with the passer then and I think he's letting him know right now about that just a little more behind it was needed Good interception. Looks like a good ball through. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Passes it through. Yarmolenko. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. A real chance to break. Gets up to head it! They've scored! All goals are welcome, but when they come at a time like that, they're priceless. A lovely header, but really, it was all about the delivery. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Change here. There's a man waiting to come on. Change being made here, presumably to tighten their defence. Look, only time will tell now if, if this is the right decision, but at least the manager hasn't done it. You know, he's reacted quickly and it needed that. PSV take what looks to be a decisive lead. Coaxed out to the wing. He 
It's a quality cross. Just a... There is the final whistle. PSV win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That eases the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. All that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.